Do you think of Skip, quote unquote Skip, as a nickname or your true name? When did you legally change it? For those who don't know this story, when my father and mother were dating, my father started calling my mother Skipper, as in you're the skipper of this ship. You tell me what to do. Hey, they were just kids. I'm, I'm not even sure either one of them actually graduated from high school. I was the firstborn. So they named me John Edward Bayless II after my father, the first. But as soon as he saw me, my father said, there's my little skipper. My mother wasn't real happy at that point. She always used to tell me, rest her soul, that it took forever to get me out of her. She always said, you were so stubborn. Yep, that's me from day one. But Skipper stuck from day one. Not once in my life, not once, was I ever called John or John Edward by either of my parents? Not, not even when my mom was furious with me, which was pretty often, not once. As I got older, Skipper became Skip. And starting in seventh grade, when you leave your elementary school, you go to, in, in our case, junior high school, where you had seven different classes, Starting then in seventh grade, every first day of school, I had to battle with all my new teachers to accept Skip as not a nickname, but as my only name. Because on the transcript, it said John Edward. As I've said before on this podcast, my father was bad to the bone, just evil. So the last thing I wanted to be associated with to carry on through life was his name. When I got to Vanderbilt, it started to occur to me that Skip is a pretty silly first name, but once I started seeing it in print, as I started writing for newspapers and saw my byline, I, I actually started thinking it's it has a pretty cool ring to it. Skip Bayless, okay. But I was still lead, leading two lives because all my legal documents were John Edward II. It's driving me crazy. So finally in Chicago, I think it was in 2001 when I was working for the Chicago Tribune, I did go to court and I managed to convince a judge that I needed to change my name to just skip, period, just skip Bayless, period. And he granted me the legal right to be forever skip. Thank you, mom and dad, for that. I hope you enjoyed that video. You ready for more? Make sure you click that subscribe button for all the exclusive content from the Skip Bayless Show. And don't forget to check out the full episode of the show wherever you get your podcasts by clicking the link in the description.